Let's take you to Teso South in Busia County, where another family is seeking justice after the death of their kin in unclear circumstances, still under Moy's regime. Titus Adungosi was an architecture student at the University of Nairobi and served as a student leader in 1982 when Moy was in power and during the time of the infamous coup. Brothers Frederick and Ernest Andungosi have for many years wondered about the mysterious death of Titus Tito Andungosi. According to them, their brother Titus, who was a former chairman of the Students' Organization of Nairobi University, was jailed for allegedly being part of the 1982 coup. Titus had been sentenced to 10 years at the committee maximum prison, but moved to Naivasha prison just a few months before his release. He died in unclear circumstances with only a few weeks to finish his sentence. Waleo. Atuja pata haki vile taita atalifanya nini, alikufa, atawakati ya mazishi, sisa tunge kuwa na uwezo, ata kuuliza wakati uo vile lifanyika, vile postmortem walifanya nini, vitu kama hizo sisi familia, uh, tukujua chochote, paka saizi ya tujui. Fearing for their lives, Frederick and their late dad sought refuge in Uganda. We went to exile to Uganda, mimi na baba yangu for a few days ili apata mani because kulikuwe kwa na tension kila muta nakuja na yake, polisi, muzao kuli, afanyi chochote. 30 years later and the family still mourn the loss of their loved one who they say was a great leader and had a promising future. Although they have not found closure over the matter, they are still seeking justice. Anita Nkonge.